Hey guys, it's your girl, Just the Glam Pixie, and there's a couple items I've really been loving this summer. I figured we still got a little bit of summer left over, so why not share them with you guys so you can find them for yourselves? So first I want to say that none of these items were given to me by the companies themselves. I'm not sponsored at all by anyone. These are just items that I was either gifted by like my friends or that I picked up by myself and I'm just really in love with them. So it's genuinely items that I've been loving this summer. I'm gonna go ahead and find the links to as many of them as possible for you guys. So if there is something that you're interested in, you can go ahead and look for them down below. And without further ado, let's get into the first item. So the first thing I'm gonna show you is this DW Richly Scented Iridescent Moon Room Spray. I've really been loving this. A little bit goes a long way, and it just keeps your room feeling really fresh. I have an animal, my little Capellia, who I love and adore, but with little dogs, you know, come little accidents. So even when you try your very, very best to clean it up immediately, you just get that a dog lives here scent. This stops that. It isn't overwhelming. It doesn't smell like overpowering and ridiculous. It doesn't smell like the Febreze that I just hate the smell of Febreze. It smells so good. It's got a really like masculine scent. They make a lot of different types. So if that's not really your vibe, then you can just find a different flavor, I guess it would be. But this is the one that I really, really love. So yeah, I definitely recommend that guy. The second item is Vaseline Lip Therapy in Aloe. So they make this in like a rose scent and they make it in the aloe. I have to say, I usually love anything rose scented and I used to really love their rose scented lip therapy. But for whatever reason now, that smell is just bothering me. I'm not liking it in their lip therapy, but this aloe is amazing. It's actually got kind of like a melony smell to it it's amazing. It keeps your lips feeling super moist. I put it on every day after my shower and before I go to bed. It has been doing wonders keeping my lips very, very moisturized, but not feeling like thick and gross. It doesn't feel gummy. It just sinks in and really moisturizes your lips. So that's been awesome. I've been loving, loving this. These next couple items are from Moon Musings Jewelry. So she's a small business owner who handcrafts all of her own jewelry. She does an amazing job. I'm gonna go ahead and link her Instagram up here and down below, as well as her Etsy shop. It's Moon Musings Jewelry at Etsy. I mean, her stuff is absolutely gorgeous. She does a lot of like crystal work. She does, I think she calls them paint splatters where she like lacquers the paint into like this amazing jewel. I mean, I, I can't get over it. Her stuff is absolutely beautiful. And she actually custom made this set for me. So we have black tourmaline drop hoop earrings and a matching black tourmaline necklace with this geode. And I mean, that I love this. I've been wearing it so much. If you don't know, black tourmaline is supposed to kind of deflect any sort of evil or ill wishes. It's also supposed to help against illness. So it's kind of an all over, just like positive thing to wear. If you don't believe in all that crystal stuff, that's fine. She has other stuff on our site too. It's all beautifully created. It's really, really well done. You can tell a lot of love and care went into these and I am digging on this set. So yeah, definitely check her out. Again, her link is gonna be up here and I'm also gonna link her down below. Now, if you're like me, you've been spending a lot of time out in your garden and with that comes burns. I hate it, I do use sunscreen, but I'm extremely fair so I still tend to burn. This stuff though helps so much. So this is the Aloe After Sun Lotion by Banana Boat and I swear by this stuff. I will never buy normal aloe ever again. It dries me out. It makes it worse. It makes me peel quickly. Whereas this stuff takes the burn out of the sunburn. Kind of, I feel like it turns it into a tan. It's bizarre. Keeps my skin moisturized, feeling soft. I mean, I love it. It doesn't have like a bad scent to it either. It doesn't smell alcoholish. It, it's just awesome. So if you spend a lot of time in the sun and even despite putting on sunscreen, still get little burns, go for this. This stuff is killer. It's such an amazing product and yeah, I swear by aloe after sun lotion now. 
all my friends. I'm like, don't buy that crap with the alcohol and aloe. No. Buy the after sun lotion. It's the best. This next item was actually a gift to me from a really sweet friend. So, hi, Mickey. I love it. I've been using it nonstop. This is the Sweet Grace Candle, and the brand is Bridgewater Candle Company. So, my friend Nikki owns this amazing store, and I was just walking around it one day with her, and she was showing me all her cool items, and she was just like, do you want that candle? You can just have that candle. It's amazing. It smells so good. It's got this, like, sweet, oh, I just, oh, it smells like, almost like candy. I absolutely love this candle. So I've never used Bridgewater Candle Company before, but I am completely sold. It's burning really, really well. It's a soy blend candle. So, I mean, it's just awesome. It leaves off such a good scent and it's in this beautiful like crackled glass. It's kind of like a rose gold with this barnwood top. So aesthetically, it's awesome. You can't really get better than that. And it also smells absolutely amazing. So again, Nikki, I absolutely love it. Thank you so very, very much, and I'm getting a lot of love and use out of it. Keeping on that smelly good trend, I'm gonna go ahead and show you a couple of my summer scents. So these are the scents that I'll typically wear to work because I do work as a dance teacher. I'm constantly moving, I'm sweating, I'm working out. I don't wanna waste my really, really good per expensive perfume when I'm probably gonna sweat it out anyway. So I usually go for body sprays, and I mean, Bath and Body Works, you can't really go wrong with Bath and Body Works. And this one is the Bali Black Coconut Sand. So if you like warm, kind of vanilla type scents with coconut in it, this right here is amazing. And this actually stays really, really well on my skin. A lot of body sprays, within an hour, I can't smell at all. When I wear this, I get compliments all day long on it. It's If you don't like the vanilla, warm type scents with coconut in it, then this is a really, really good alternative for you for summer. So this is the Havana Tropical Vanilla and Cherim Cherimoya, Cherimoya, I don't know how you say that. But to me, I don't smell vanilla in this at all. I smell salty air and sand. Like this is such a clean summer scent. Every time I spray this, it takes me to the beach. Like it, it just, it just does. I just, I smell the beach air, I smell the sand, I smell the salt, but not that nasty beach smell that you always get from the porta potties. That's not included. But yeah, this stuff is an amazing, like clean, basic scent. So if you don't like things that smell too sweet or warm for summer, this is a really, really good alternative for you too, because it's awesome. I will say this one doesn't stay on me quite as long like the Coconut Sands does, but it does work pretty well, especially for such a light scent. It will linger for a pretty good time. So yeah, definitely pick that up. It's awesome. The next item I'm going to show you is this WXY portable steamer. So I hate, 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 hate ironing. I absolutely hate it. It's such a pain. You've got to pull out the big old ironing board. You got to let it heat. It's obnoxious in the way every time you finish ironing one section go to the next by the time that section's ironed you turn it back over and the previous section is now wrinkled it's just frustrating it takes forever i hate ironing so i was looking for kind of an easy alternative and i've never owned a steamer ever i don't think i've ever even used a steamer before now and it was prime day and i sure enough looked online and found this steamer for 12.99 that's not what i spent on this steamer I will say now it looks like it's a little bit pricier. So right now I think it's about $26.99, but this thing's awesome and it's completely portable. So you get it here. It's just like a little handheld and it opens up pretty easily. You just fill that little reservoir with water and you relock it maybe, yeah. Relock it, plug it in, turn it on. Within 60 seconds, it is hot enough to steam your clothes. Like, and when I say steam, I mean, you just run that sucker down and the wrinkles were gone like that. It's insane. And it's definitely small enough to pack. It also comes with this handy little don't burn me oven mitt. Yeah, I think it's cute and it's got like a silvery finish to it. So that actually helps because you wanna pull your clothes tight while you're using the steamer. So it keeps you from getting burned. This thing, it really is awesome. Like I'm very, very impressed after, you know, suffering with crappy ironing boards and irons for years and just being so frustrated with it. I'm really happy to have that now, especially that I can just pack it in when I'm traveling for work and not look like a schlep with wrinkly clothes. So that was a total score. 
Sadly, it's not the same price as it was on Amazon Prime Day, but it's still a pretty good price. And I honestly would pay the $26.99 for it too, because it's been very nice to literally just pop that sucker on and in half the time have beautifully steamed clothes with no wrinkles. Yeah, I think that's it, you guys. Those are the things that I've been seriously loving this summer. Um, some really, really good products. Some of them which I've used for a couple summers in the past, like that Aloe Sun After Sun Lotion I've used for years now. And other things that I've never used, like the steamer and my beautiful jewelry and these perfumes. I mean, I just have a lot of really great stuff that I've been loving this summer. So go ahead and make sure you check out the links below. Remember, I'm not sponsored. No one paid me to do this. This is just stuff that I wanted to share with you because if I like it, you might like it. So yeah, check it out down below. I'll link everything that I possibly can so you can find it by yourself. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you like videos kind of like this. I do a lot of thrifting, DIY, styling, favorites, stuff like that. So I hope to see you guys in the next video and until then, bye!